Good morning. Today we're looking at the heat shield on the side of the elm. As you can see, there's a fire in its belly. Small fire, it's burned down. But it's still going to show us what we need to know about the temperature of the stove. If we can focus on this little gizmo, it says it's about uh, 450 degrees on the side of the stove. The, the bear is in the low 200s, pretty much all over the place. And the idea is to reduce the heat of the bricks on the wall. 97, 96, go down by the floor, 86, the hearth itself, 91, back to the bear, there again, low 200s, and the side of the stove again, in the 450 range. We'll take a look at <clears throat> Here's a shield which is freestanding. Okay, 135. Bricks behind it, 106. And this side of the stove, if we can focus once again, 470s. And the hearth, a lot of technical numbers here. But the idea is that behind, behind the bricks, there is a conventional stud wall, sheetrock over wood frame, and I wanted to reduce the heat of the bricks, which would, uh, well, they do a great thing. They absorb a lot of that heat during the day and then uh, give it back if the, the stove is ever um, burned down almost out of, out of wood, say in the wee hours of the morning. Anyway, this is my stove in my home, and the bear is suspended using two carriage bolts from the warming shelf, which is nickel plated and partially painted in the same green as the stove itself. Another thing I did, don't want this video to run too long, um, I decided to replace the stove pipe this year and in, uh, in an effort to make it draw easier, particularly in the fall when, uh, when you get low barometric pressure rainy days. I went from a uh, six inch connection on the stove itself, whoops, to seven inch pipe, which then goes up to eight inch. The thimble is eight inch, and then it goes into the chimney. And I believe it draws easier um, we'll know for certain when we begin to get some of that fine brown powder collecting on the inside surface of it. That tends to slow down the flue gases. But for now, I'm a happy camper. One more look at this beautiful stove with the solid brass trim. And back to work. Thank you very much for watching.